Hey there, welcome to Beginning Drawing with me, Brad Dinsmore. I'm going to be your instructor this quarter, and uh, I'm, uh, I've been a drawing instructor at Green River since 2009, but this is really um, just my second time teaching uh, Beginning Drawing online. I'm happy with the work that we got to do last quarter when the pandemic uh, happened and we were all forced to, to go online. Um, and so, you know, we did some really cool stuff and I'm really proud with the, of the work my students uh, put in and accomplished uh, in the spring 2020. Uh, summer 2020, uh, we're going to take on the, some of that success that we built and, um, and just keep making improvements. And so hopefully you'll see some of those improvements throughout this class as I re-record videos and do different demos. And uh, I'm always just trying to make this uh, the best experience for you guys at home. So um, with that said, um, if there's anything that you see that's like I can make more clear, um, feel free just to send me uh, an email or, or somehow get a hold of me and let me know um, what your questions might be or your concerns or comments. And I will try to, you know, make this, uh, make it as good as possible for you guys. Um, uh, with that said, um, also there's announcements each week. So because we're not, we don't have... Uh, face-to-face -face class time here. It's not like a hybrid where we are meeting Zoom meetings or anything like this. This is all just on your on your own. Um, it's, it's important that you guys uh, check in a couple week a couple times a week just to um, see if I've made any announcements for you guys. So that's my just keep just keep checking that email, keep checking that um, that canvas and uh, let me know if you have any questions, okay? Also, um, with that said, I really recommend you guys uh, setting out some time every week for this class. My expectation is uh, we should have about six to seven hours of class time per week. So you should expect to use that six to, six to seven hours uh, a week for this class. All right. So you can divide up. You can if you want to do a six hour day of drawing <laughs> or whatever. Uh, that you could do that. I don't recommend that. You, drawing fatigue will set in and um, you will find it being, that's difficult. So I think two to three times a week of drawing would probably be, would be great. It, particularly maybe just, uh, maybe just two uh, longer sessions would be the best. Three, three and a half hour long ses sessions. Okay, so that'd be my suggestion to you. But again, however you do it, however this um, class works for you, it will be, it's fine. It's totally online. Um, just one more thing before we, before I let you go, um, you guys need to get your paper really quick. You look in the, in the module and it will, there's a link to your supply list. So if you haven't got your supplies, you need to go get those right away. A um, couple things. Um, this was my pad from last quarter. So I did all my drawings in here, which you will see as you go through the class. I'm not going to show you them right now, uh, but I got another one for this quarter. So I got a fresh, fresh start. And again, I'm probably going to draw on this part just so I like to make it my own. Take ownership of your education, guys, and because um, it's important. So I take ownership of my my sketchbook, too. I'm like, it's a, it's a lovely drawing. It's just not my drawing. So I want to, uh, I don't need to see, see this one. All right. So get some paper. Uh, there's information and suggestions about the paper in the module. So do that. Um, you'll need some pencils for this class. Um, I suggest um, a set. I like this, uh, a set like this where it has the base, basically like a 2H through a 9B. That's, I think, the, the best that you, best range for pencils. Um, if you really want to get by, you could probably get by with just like a, an HB, just a standard HB pencil, like that yellow one with a pink eraser that you use on all the Scantrons. That one, and then you could get like a 2B or 3B and then a 9B. And I think with just using those three pencils, you could accomplish everything you want to accomplish with graphite drawing. So uh, obviously having, all right, this is a little bit nicer, but if you're on a budget, you could do that. The other thing, and this is the last thing, because I really tried to um, eliminate um, some, uh, some materials just to keep the cost down low, because again, we're in this uh, strange times and Budgets are tight. They're they're usually tight, but they're extra tight right now for, for many of us. So 
The last thing would be a pen. Uh, we use the Micron pen here, um, and this is an 01. That's what I recommend. Uh, but if you don't want one of those, you could just use a ballpoint pen if you wish. But I do recommend those. And again, all this stuff is in the module, so if you, um, if you need to check that out, check it out. All right. Take care, guys. Hey, and then we've got another uh, intro video part two that I re actually recorded last year. I'm just going to use the same one. So anyway, take care, and um, we'll see you. All right.